if a female doesn't get married, she fell in a relationship. That's that, true. Remember that shit? That is true. That's a motherfucking That fool. is true. A fool. 100% example. true. Why is it true? Because that's all women want. Too many women in this generation, bro. We're definitely doing a prenup, bro. I got to, bro. Because in a relationship, would you split it 50 50 with the lady? Like, if I name? got it, no. Like, I'm saying marriage wise, would if you put I got her it, name? no. Would you put her name on the house with you? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to another podcast. We trying to do two podcasts every week. You know what I'm saying? So that's what we're trying to do, man. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. We're about to introduce everybody here and shit. Like, um, it's White Kiss, man. Y'all know what it is. You can find me on IG. W A D K Y S. How about your boy, man? I'm Hill. What's up, man? My name is Ken. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you can you find me. So smooth, bro. Come on, just talk normal, bro. <laughs> <laughs> man, don't be mad because the bitch gonna love me when yeah, they see yeah, me on the cam, cuz. You, you be soldier hating, dog. Saying, nah, dog. You be soldier hating, dog. But look, follow me on the ground. Follow me on the ground at Lissat Chaser, Chasing, man. L I S A C K C H A S A A. Yeah. Go ahead, Robert. Two. What I'm doing, Emerson? Huh? What? what, what you what gotta you introduce doing? yourself, man. Yeah, they don't know who I, they don't know who I am. They don't know who you are, bro. Okay. Yeah. For the people that don't know who I am, <laughs> I am. You might come across new people that never seen the channel. Nigga, you gotta introduce yourself. Does everybody know who the fuck I am? All right, you heard? Man. All right, man. I'm Emerson Richard. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> 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 he giving out his fucking government. <laughs> what they gotta do? Fucking you gotta hack me, a nigga. <laughs> Look, I'm editing this. You ain't take that gay ass shit out you said in the car. <laughs> you was rapping. No, that was because I, said I was out here sucking dick. Uh, I didn't say that, bro. Can't say hey, hey, I was freestyling. And you say you it don't count. 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 <laughs> um, but let's get back to the spot, man. It don't count. It don't count, but it's a freestyle, bro. So you can say whatever in a freestyle. Yes, it's a freestyle, bro. So it's, like, it's like it's like hey, 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 hey. it's like a comedian. Everybody. It's like a comedian making a joke. It don't count, bro. It's a, it's a, it's a funny joke. It's my dog, young thugger, man. That's crazy, bro. It's a, it's like a comedian. You are making jokes. It don't count, bro. Like it just yeah, bro. Let's get to this fucking podcast, bro. <laughs> I don't know if this is an exposed Emerson pod right now. Come on, bro. <laughs> If you freestyle, okay, and you say, I'm sucking dick. Nah, I didn't even know you Hell say, no, nigga. You can't, say, you can't say shit, nigga. You said you're gonna suck dick in the freestyle. How you like, 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 what, what made you think about that? <laughs> just, 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 well, how did it come up in your head? I know it's it's freestyle or rap. Okay. But it's a freestyle, don't count, bro. Hey man, let's get back into this podcast. So Emerson, how was oh your day? Don't start with me, bro. Start with me, bro. Start with me, bro. You've been on my ass since the fucking fuck. Whoa, whoa, no diddy. No diddy. There you go, there you go again, there bro. There you go again. You just don't care, don't you? It's a it's a freestyle, don't count? I was going to ask you how your day was. Why are you coming to me first, though? What was that? Father of the hand. Don't start with anybody but me. Miami Sunday, man. You know what I'm saying? We was, we was out there living, dog. I got mad pictures. Yeah, my day was straight from, you know what I'm saying? I didn't really do too much. I just, I just chill. <laughs> Why just the fuck you laugh? <laughs> what is your you problem? You got something to say, no, man? Oh, we're going to go back to the freestyle. No. <laughs> How you been, Walkers? <laughs> I'm like, you can never take shit seriously. No, you know that? Not with this nigga. My day. My day was great. I worked today, 12 hour shift. Bro, I'm sorry, bro. Are we wasting your time, bro? No, Tell what I'm thinking about right now. Let's tie it up. Let's tie it up. You ready? Start a podcast. You ready? So, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of RS3 Nation podcast, man. Uh, we hosting the episode with the fellas. We are gonna get started because Emerson knows we start every episode like this on his motherfucking uh, neck. You heard? 
So if you ever looked at the podcast, this is how we start. This is how we get him uh, going, you know? How else did we get you going? Okay. You don't need to say shit. Shut up. All right. <clears throat> I'm not going to say nothing, bro. So t- no phone. Questions coming straight what off the dome. That? All right. You didn't like my dramatic drop? That's dumb as shit, but go ahead. You sound like you're angry again. I'm not angry. When my shit dropped, it was a dramatic effect. Okay. <laughs> like your ground just motherfucking go shit. Go ahead. You heard? Uh-huh. All right, man. So these questions are going to be off the dome. Emerson, do you got a top five? Oh, my God, bro. Why you start with me, bro? You not have a microphone? <laughs> I was boat riding. That's what I should ask you. You boat riding? Yeah. How you got over here? Nigga, I don't have no fucking boats. He's oh, being God. fucking funny, bro. He's <laughs> talking about some racist shit, bro. Bro, I don't do boats, bro. <clears throat> nah, so you got a top five? Not sports, but like a top five, like, girls you've been with list. Top five? And do oh. you know your top five? But oh. you finna say all of them? No, 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 no. I don't really, I don't really like, I don't have like a list. Oh, yeah, she's first, she's second, she's third, she's fourth, she's fifth. <laughs> do you niggas have lists? I got a top five. Top yeah, you got a top five? I feel like everybody got a top five. Okay, so where's the the motherfuckers I think first? Where, How do you having top fives? I don't be having top fives. So all them, all them the same. I'm celibate. All right, oh, all, right. all right, all right, buddy, buddy. All of them the same. Yeah, and nobody's the same. You confuse me sometimes. You confuse. What me. I say? So, nobody's the same. So you had one guy. You were like, oh, this shit was terrible, though. Yeah, you can. You, okay, yeah. then. So you. Have but one. I don't have a top five. Yes, I got a top five. I like I said, I only. <laughs> I only had five, so I have a top five for sure. I have- the motherfuckers I was like first, right? You have one that's first, right? Not my first. She's your like first one, right? Like, yeah, she was the best. She was the. Uh, yeah. Why didn't it work out? Like, if she was like so good, like. Hey, damn, nigga! God damn. <laughs> Sex is everything, Emerson. Your top five could have somebody that was a one night stand. Yeah, my top five ain't got no one night. Facts, no, but I'm saying though, I'm but I'm saying though, I'm saying I don't either. But I'm saying though, you my could top have one, got a one night stand. You heard? You know what I mean? There is. You probably have that one girl that you hit her to you. She weren't in the top five, but to her, like yo, you feel me? I'm in everybody top five. You know? All right, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we just weren't looking for the same thing at that time, and I we just grew apart, and I I grew up, and we we grew up. Shit, I'm still cool with her, and you know, I'm a real nigga. None of my exes hate me. What happened to your best one since you, since you so goddamn? Serious? Yeah, what happened to you? I was in high school, and I moved. No, for real though, I was I was in high school and shit. Yeah, yeah. Decision to move to Florida for some reason. I don't know why. Um, but I made a decision to move to Florida. So and you left for bro? Yeah, that's fucked up. Would rather have? Would you rather have a woman who cook clean in the house? You pay all the goods. You feel me? And she keep the house clean, cook clean and tidy, you feel me, and straightened up? Or would you rather have a woman who want to go 50-50 and she works? She works. I, I don't want nobody to just stay in the house. I'm going to be honest. So what happens? I want you to get some shit. Like, why do you get this 50-50 that, don't, that she, re- she really cooks? She really do your clothes because yeah. she always working. Or you want a girl that's in the house that's going to cook for you. Every time you get home, but I don't, and do I don't all your like laundry. You get, get the fuck on. Unless we have kids, I don't, you shouldn't even be at the house. Like I'm saying, like not even should be at the house, but like you shouldn't even stay at the house 24 seven cleaning and doing. The, no, bro. If you have kids, I understand that even more. But if you don't have kids, if what's the point of her staying in the house cleaning the fabric? Fuck, what are you doing? Do something. Be productive. As a Haitian man, for me, I would rather be the, like the provider. Yeah. You feel me? I will take care of you. I'll do everything and shit. I pay for the house. I do all that, right? I don't expect you to stay at home. I would love for my lady to have a hobby that gets her money. You feel me? Yeah. I want you to do your little thing. You're not stressing for work. I want you to relax. You feel? I don't give a shit if you go out with your girls and shit, but have respect enough. Right. You feel me? Bitch, I'm going to see what you're wearing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say yeah, something. Yeah. I ain't going to tolerate any bullshit. Mm. But on some shit, if you want to like, Get a hobby that gets you some bread, so you don't constantly ask me for money, and I can I can like take care of what I gotta do. That's cool. Don't nag me. That's all I ask for. But I will take care of everything. Just you can be a stay at home mom if you want. Yeah. Just don't be blowing me. You feel me? Because I'm a. Mm. Like yeah, like I don't expect you to cook every day, but at least order me something to eat. Yeah. At least show me that you were thinking. That. <laughs>
like that's it. I just want you to do something productive. Yeah. You just don't. You you can linger for three days in the house, but after that, wait, go do something. Yeah. Like don't just stay here. Cause I want some me time too. Yeah. You feel me? That's all. I know he doing. He trying to get the ladies. Oh, he trying to do. He trying to get the ladies side. I think I want uh. Shit. He be fucking this man. Fuck. This nigga, bro. Fucking. Let the man answer the question. You want him to, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, man. Nah, I think I want somebody to stay at the crib. I ain't gonna lie to you. I want Probably somebody to stay at. Ooh. Nah, she good. Nah, you gotta say something about that. She, if she gonna want somebody to stay at the crib, you know? Clean the house. Hopefully she can cook, you know? Because actually, I'm a chef in the kitchen. So I really don't. I, most of the time, I really don't need you for, for, for nothing but your company sometimes. So when I say stay at the crib, it's like for you stay at the crib, make you know what I'm saying? For shit, if you see shit dirty, clean it up. Don't be the motherfucker that see shit dirty and then wait till I get home. Like, oh, I was gonna get it, but I got bit nah. I can handle about that. If you're gonna be at the crib, make sure the crib nice and tidy, you know what I'm saying? Make sure it's good <clears throat> when you come home. You know what I'm saying? Be presentable, you know? Um be respectable. Respect the crib like it's your own, you know. So it ain't her crib. Nah, nah, fuck no. <laughs> Respect it like it's your own, but also that like, I want somebody to stay at home, and I make sure that she good. If uh, you know what I'm saying, in a relationship, would you split it fifty fifty with the lady? Like, if I name? got it, no. Like I'm saying, marriage wise, would if you put I her got name? It, no. Would you put her name on the house with you, like together? So if you guys do leave, she can also take half. Would you do be able to do that? Oh, she. If we married, we locked in. Ain't no switching up. Till death do us part. Yeah, for real. I'm gonna tell you now. If we get married, I'm signing the motherfucking prenup. You, you, and you ain't getting shit out of me, bro. It's too many women in this generation, bro. Where, 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 where you, 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 you will work for all everything you got. You feel me? And you'll work for it. You'll work for it. You'll work hard, bro. And then soon, soon as you get with this woman, bro, y'all get married. Now everything that that shirt is attached to her name now. Nah, but like that that's just me personally. You feel me? That's just me personally because I feel like now if we we if I end up wanting to leave you and I wanna have a divorce and you you trying to split everything with me and you ain't even work for it, you feel me? You just feel like that's a walking ticket. So that's how I feel like I'll stop a woman like if I'm famous or if I got some type of money like I'm up. I'm going I'm going I'm I'm definitely doing a prenup, bro. I got to, bro, because females they they lay like to take advantage of marriage is a dangerous game. It's not a game. I mean, this kind of, it might be a game for the female. I don't know. Whoever you married. Speak about marriage. Remember we had this last conversation. You said if a female doesn't get married, she failed in a relationship. Remember that's that, true. Remember that shit? That is true. That's a motherfucking That fool. is true. A fool. 100% example. true. Why is it true? Because that's all a woman wants out of the relationship at the end. Getting married. So she don't get married. She failed? She failed. That was her goal. That was the book. I don't know if I'd agree with it as in she failed. I would say that relationship failed, but that no. Failed. The only thing I say um the female failed because niggas don't really be thinking about marriage. That like niggas, yeah, if a bitch want to get married, like ah, I married no myself, because I've been with her for a couple of years. I'm yeah, yeah. Her. But bitches really think about getting married, like thinking about the dress, going, I, I don't see think her so. Family, yeah, all that shit. Getting the you know what I'm saying the girls, all the that. girls like the festivities and shit. But I think a man wants to get married more than a girl do. No, no, I'm going to be honest. Let me I'm finish, honest. Let me finish ahead, motherfucker, because you said what you said. Go ahead. I'm just saying, I feel like in a relationship, a man is the one that wants to get married because he's thinking about going to her dad, getting that big ass ring. You're going to have to make sure you make it all sweet and shit, propose, make it look good. You going the extra mile. She's not planning any of that shit. It's until you propose that she's getting excited to get married. Until then, you want that shit. But then I say, don't most females like give you like a, oh, uh, we've been together for like four years. Um, and, 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 That's this and, and, generation and, 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 that don't know how she to might really not say give like, a oh, fuck I wanna, about oh, each other. Who don't really want marry me right now, but she might give you hints like, oh, we've been together for it's four because, years. It's huh? because that and, girl really, it's she's she's in a rush for something. You got to watch out for that shit. That's you as a man. You are supposed to know when you want to get married, not the other way around. If a lady's making you want to get married, it ain't your lady. She she trying to get in quick on something, but it's like it's like on something like because if you've been with her for for years and stuff like bro, 
I gotta marry her, bro. Something because like, we she been cool with me. That and shit been feels forced. So you and and might feel forced, but on some shit, my like because I said, like I said, a nigga don't give a fuck about being married. But like they, if they be on some shit, like if I been with her for a couple years, like, I don't mind getting married to her or some shit. Like I'll just do it. I'm just, I don't think that's yeah. how. I don't that's think nobody thinks like that, bro. Because I'm not gonna force a marriage. This, yeah, I'm not if I'm forcing this marriage, that means this is this is something that it's I, not really like forcing, bro. Like if lo- the what you said, you said I've been with her for a couple years. So yeah, I'm like, but it's no, like you niggas, fuck with her. It's like no. You don't mind getting married, so like she's been giving me hints, like I fuck with her, I'll marry her, I'll I'll I'll, I'll make her happy, I'll, you know what I'm saying? Awesome. Because she want it. Nigga, you all right? Hey, I'm gonna be honest. If you if you if you've been with the bitch for like four or five years and after you get married you see your true colors, you dumb as shit. Simple as that. You should have saw that shit a long time ago. No, I'm not saying I'm I really gotta I really gotta like love this girl and feel like yeah, I can see myself with her for a long ass time for yeah. the rest of it. I'm not I don't give a damn with you for six, seven, ten years. If I feel like any time that this shit can break up or we been hitting too many rocky bottoms, I'm not gonna get married to you. If I'm having way too many arguments, I'm not gonna marry you for what? What I'm marrying you for? To, to say I did it and say you got a ring? No, I'm not. I'm not. Why do you think men are always the one that gets rejected from a proposal? You've never heard of female say, "Oh, I got rejected because I asked him to marry me." <laughs> you can't win nothing with this guy. What you mean? I'm not got rejected before. Have you heard about that shit? I ain't never heard that. What, so female don't get rejected? Because she proposed to a man. I mean, are you talking about proposing? Yes. Oh, female marriage. don't, oh, like, get on one you proposing? To ask a girl to marry you, that's Oh, go, 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 my bad, my bad, I'm thinking something else, never mind, never mind. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bitches don't ask niggas to propose. Exactly, exactly the point, because okay, okay, this man okay. is the one that wants that marriage. I thought you were talking about something, my bad, my bad. Huh? Girls want the party in the dress. The men want the ring. Like I said, bro, most niggas, bro, they've been with a bitch for five or six years, bro. They're like... All right, bro. We cool. Um, yeah. Everything's wrong. The bitch haven't done anything wrong to him, man. It's not like what oh, the bitch is like. Uh, uh, uh. It's just like, bro. The bitch give me little hints, like, yeah, she wanna get married. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna do it for her. Like, I don't mind getting married, but like, That's it's cool. Awesome. That's what I'm saying. It's not like because when I say I don't mind getting married, it's not like, oh, I don't want to marry the bitch. No, no, no. Like, it's hell no. It's like, it's cool because because, because niggas worry. don't really like. It's not like some crazy like, oh my god, I'm about to get fucking married. Oh my god, I'm about to have a fucking party. That means something that you're not really fully invested. You're not it's committed not, to. Bro, it's you not even about it. committed, bro. It's not even about... It's just like... You're it's cool. You're not fully invested, bro. That's you cool. don't really care about I cool means like I can get married. So you niggas care about getting married. Is that what you're saying? Yes. I feel like I, I care about getting married to the right one. Yeah. One day I want to get married, yeah. Maybe I'm the only one. Let me know down below if I'm the only one. I, I don't really give a fuck about married. I don't know. Real talk. Like, I, Not I just me. Get married at some point. Like, like, she want to get married? Uh, yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or maybe he went through some shit. Yeah. You meet the right person, you're like, damn, you don't know that I was married.